Early morning, Sandown Racecourse, and British racing goes on the front foot, with the horse comes first. Representatives from leading organisations in British horse racing are meeting to hear about the horse comes first. They're working together to raise awareness of the high levels of equine welfare in their sport. Welcome to the launch of the Horse Comes First. The Horse Comes First campaign is a critical foundation for the future success of our sport. We do a great job with horse welfare. I don't think we're getting that message across quite as well as we could. And the Horse Comes First really provides us a, a vehicle where we can be more robust and more front foot around how we get that message across. What we're trying to tell people is that horse welfare is very, very important, that, that our performance around horse welfare is improving. We're putting £23 million, or have put £23 million into research and training and education around horse welfare. We treat it incredibly seriously and that, that we're not complacent. I mean, these are the, these, and, and that to make this all much more visible to people. At the heart of The Horse Comes First is a film now available to view on The Horse Comes First website. The film reveals the care and consideration involved in training horses for competition, giving a level of access to the racing industry that's rarely seen. Those of us who work in or worked in racing take it for granted. We take for granted that the, the, the care is there. We take for granted that people feel real responsibility for the animals. But because they do it on a day-to-day -day basis, they don't talk about it, they don't shout about it, they don't promote it. And so people looking in from the outside might not realise how much they care about the horses, how much they like them, how much they want their lives to be as good as they possibly can be. So what this campaign does, hopefully, it reminds those working in the industry exactly how high our standards are, and it lets people outside of the industry look in and see for themselves how high our standards are. Chuck Bennett was named Employee of the Year at this year's Godolphin Stud and Stable Staff Awards. He's right behind the horse comes first, because he knows from experience the specialist attention that racehorses receive. We feed our horses four times a day, so they're never without food. They've got ad-lib water, um, they've got the staff coming in first thing in the morning, um, you know, they're ridden out at exercise, the bedding's um, mopped out, kept clean and tidy, you know, come back in the night, you've got the lads to brush them off, you've got yard managers going around checking the well-being of their legs, you've got the vets on site who can immediately, immediately give treatment one way or the other, you've got that. 24/7. We have nightmen that work. Obviously, they have vets on call. You know, and um, so they get they get better looked after than we do as humans. I think. The horse comes first is being promoted across racecourses, backed by a website explaining more about the high levels of horse welfare in British racing. <laughs>